Okay, battle number 25 with this team. Let's go ahead and get started. It is raining quite a bit outside and I have the window open just to cool things down, so hopefully that won't interfere with the audio. But if you hear strange noises, that's why. All right, interesting team. Um, might lead with Tapu Koko, might lead probably with Tapu Koko, I would say. Uh, I have an idea, so let's try leading with Heatran. I'm hoping he leads with Tapu Koko and then U turns into Halucha. Hoping to use a fighting move against Heatran. If that happens, I can probably one shot Halucha with Overheat. I should have started the timer. I'm not sure if the um, if the team selection timer is the same as the regular timer. If you spend forever during uh, selecting your first Pokemon, do you then start with a very low timer? Um, so Excadrill is probably faster, I just I don't think I can risk this. I'd love to stay in, he's probably going to Stealth Rock or something expecting a switch, but yeah, okay, good. Sometimes it's good to play it safe, as I learned uh, last time as well. Um, now he's probably not going to keep in Excadrill. Probably gonna bring. I don't know who he'd bring in, but um, let's go for Stone Edge. Self Rock. Okay. Well, might as well defog now. Rock Tomb is gonna slow me down here. Um. See, now he's probably gonna do something else. But let's go for Earthquake. Maybe he'll try to pop Stealth Rock again. He's taking his time, which usually means the switch. Maybe he'll bring a Tapu Koko. No, he stayed in, okay. Well, he does have up Stealth Rock now. Um, and I'm guessing he's gonna U-turn into Halucha. He could also use Hidden Power Ice. Sometimes Tapu Koko carries that. I don't want Vaporeon to take a Volt Switch. And I don't want Magnezone to come in and be U-turned into Halucha, so... Let's go for Defog, because I really need to... Oh, he predicted that. And I'm sure he's going to send me to Earthquake and probably turn into Halucha this turn. So, no Reflect, he's getting Halucha set up. Okay, not what I expected, I should have done something different there. But I didn't. Um, hmm. Let's bring in Magnezone. I think a uh, Corkscrew Crash should take out Capu Coco or Halucha. And I don't know... Okay. After Light Screen, maybe not. Not quite. Did a lot of damage, though, so... Let's just Flash Can again. Yeah, I was expecting a U-turn. Uh, I'm still thinking he's getting Halucha prepped up for a sweep, or really it could be anything prepped for a sweep at this point. Dual Screens, Capu Coco can be a very powerful utility Pokémon. I'm assuming it has Lake Clay, so now we have to deal with them. Um, what I really need to get in here is a Defog. Um, it's probably going to use its Quiver Dance first. Yep, okay. So, can a Bug Buzz take out Landorus? Uh, uh, maybe it doesn't have Bug Buzz? I don't know why it didn't use it, but... What's cool there is Default gets rid of screens, which I didn't know until very recently. So, um, that's cool. I don't want Landorus to die. So, I'm going to bring in Vaporeon. And try to get a Scald off. Um, let's start with the Wish, though. Play it safe. Okay, definitely glad I got that Wish. Now, he's probably going to expect me to, to... I don't know. Be smart, I'll call this in Quiver Dance. He's smart, okay. So I should have um, outpredicted him there, but I didn't want to risk losing Vaporeon. So this could be a little bit bad. Um, yeah, I probably should not have let him get set up like this. Because Vaporeon is not really specially defensive invested. Um, and now that it's boosted, I can bring in Landorus, but it's faster, that's the thing bring in Dragonite, but I don't know, I might have to bring in Dragonite. I 
Probably wouldn't be faster, though. I could bring in Heatran to Ancient Power it after the boost. Let's, um... I just don't know what Volcarona could possibly know. I have some time. Let me look it up. I would, oh, it knows Bug Buzz. So, okay, we know its moveset already. And it knows Psychic, which means... Um... Alright, I have an idea here. Eh, that's not worth doing. I was gonna bring in Pinsir, try to get the flame thing, flame body going, but um, it doesn't really matter because I wasn't gonna use a fire attack, so. Psychic did a decent chunk, luckily he trained resists. Oh, special defense drop. That sucks. That's huge. Um, wasn't a knockout anyway, but he's. He's probably going to stay in. Z-Power. Uh, Shattered Psyche. Interesting choice of Z-Powers. So, that's not great. Um, I do have priority, though. So, let's Mega Evolve Pinsir. And go for Quick Attack. It's my, my only real choice at this point. Um, and it's flying, so maybe I should have done that first. But I don't think it would have... Well, I don't know if it would have knocked it out or not. I guess it... Well, Corona has really weak defenses. I should have done that. But... Um, I didn't. Alright, Tapu Koko's here. Probably going to go for a U-turn, if I had to guess. Or I could put up screens again. I'm going to assume it's going to put up Reflect, to be honest with you. My Wisher is gone, so that sucks. Taunt? Okay. So that was a good choice on my part then. So his screen setter is gone. Okay. So now things are a little more even. He gets his defense increase there. Um, and I'm faster though, right? Or no, because now he has Unburden because of his seed boost. So I don't know how much Quick Attack is going to do, unfortunately. I know it'll do a lot, but will it do enough? I guess there's not a reason... I might as well get the Intimidate off. So good for Swords Dance. Okay, not enough... Acrobat... right, Acrobatics. I was thinking Stone Edge. I don't know why I wasn't thinking Acrobatics. I should have... should have brought in Landorus. Um... That would have been the thing to do there, clearly. Alright, so... Couple choices here. Really want to get that debuff on him. Um, that defense increase, I just... I can't knock him out after one Stone Edge. So he's probably going to use Acrobatics here. I can't really afford to bring in Dragonite, because that thing is faster. So let me just get some damage on it. Okay, there's the Swords Dance. Would have been nice to crypt, I guess it probably wouldn't have mattered there. Um, he's going to go first again, and I'm sure use Acrobatics. Hmm, okay, i got to think about this, because this is he's going to knock out whatever I send in. Um, I could switch to get another Intimidate off, which probably would allow Dragonite to survive something. Maybe that's the way to go here. But then if he brings in Gyarados, I'm in trouble. So... Alright. Don't know if this is going to work. End it, Roos. Okay, so now he's going to use High Jump Kick. That, I should have gone for the... Well, it wouldn't really matter. That was a, a safe play. Alright, um... I think I have to just pray that High Jump Kick misses. I don't really think I have much of a choice. I could switch in again. But he's, he might Swords Dance? Nope, didn't miss. Okay. Um, I, there might have been a better option there. I could have switched in Landers again for the debuff. Um, my concern is just who he sends out next, though, because I only have Outrage on Dragonite, but he doesn't know that. So, the trouble is he could just keep roosting all day. Alright, let's bring in Dragonite here. Um, with the defense drop, I think I need to go for Dragon Dance, even though it won't make me faster. It'll make me faster, but not faster than Halucha. But, um, yeah, it's a tough one. 
All right, so I don't know what my speed is now, but I'm sure his is going to be higher. Because it can be 368 and it's doubled by Unburden. Um, so yeah, my speed is 426 and it doesn't really say what his speed is, but I assume it's Unburden. Um, if I was faster, I could Roost. That would be ideal, but I'm not. I don't think I can survive another Acrobatics, unfortunately. Okay, I got to make a move. I'm going to lose, but yeah. Oh, well, kind of glad I'm switching teams here. I enjoyed this team a lot, but it could definitely improve, um, as we've seen in the last few battles. So he's going to Acrobatics and win. Really nothing I can do against that. I feel like there were one or two calls I could have made there that would have been better, but I still, uh, I still was at a uh, disadvantage for most of that game. All right, well, hopefully I can get a few wins in tonight. Thank you guys for watching, and see you again soon.